All right. This is Mitchell, and uh, Will's whistling right now. And I am Will, and this is episode 13? 13. 13 of Pokemon, of Pokemon White Week. Virgin, and we started by getting some fresh water. How great is that? By fresh, oh, wait, we mean... Oh, I already knew normal type. Oh, so we're in a normal type gym. Are we? Yep. Oh. By fresh, we mean we went to the stream, purified it ourselves, we boiled it, um, put a little saline in there, cleaned it all out, and now we've got ourselves some water. Yum. There's like a stream not that far from here, actually, that has pretty nice dirty water. Really? Yeah. Oh. Yeah, we could totally drive there. Uh, we don't need beaver, because beaver's gross. No, beaver's disgusting. Okay. <laughs> it's, da it's downtown. Oh, there's well, that's, this... that's kind of far from here. There's this area that, like, this... Jesus Christ, it's Pat Rats level 17. We're okay. Rock Blast? Oh, it's sand attack. It's okay. But there's this area, like, that all the stoners that live near us hang out. And everybody calls it Beaver Pond. And it's not even a pond. Well, it's like... Well, I mean, there, there's, like... It's a gathering of water, but it's technically but, running. It but, is running. Well, it, it's a gathering of water because it, it rains a lot here. Yeah. Right, it rains a lot here. So that's, like, where the water comes from. But, like, everybody Pretty calls much. it Beaver Pond, and it's just, like, where kids go to smoke. That and the cross-country kids go just to hang out. But most... Oh, wait, hold on. What am I supposed to be doing? I have no idea. What, um, what's this book? that. Children's, Children's books. books. Nice to yes. meet you, Pokemon. It's a fairy tale about a little boy who met a Pokemon for the first time in his life. <laughs> He's with a small brown, brown Pokemon. Up, oh, there's a memo between the pages. Pokemon the... trainers, ah. I'm the gym leader Lenora. I had four memos. I, I oh, wish yes, said now the first question. What is the first memes. Pokemon you met in this gym? It's now, a pet rat. Yeah, now try to find it. It's the I'm first confused. shelf on the middle row. How do you know? That's what it said. Oh, okay. Yes. Uh, Pat, da, da, da. Pat Rat raises his tail, and that means I'm it's season enemy. Because I thought the question was easy. Well, this is the second question. Flame birds inside its body, and it gives off smoke from its head while it, it runs. runs. What, what is, is this, this book? book? Somebody may be reading it. So look for someone reading a book. Well, it's one of those two. Yeah. Oh, man, I don't like reading. How do we... No. <laughs> yes? About what? Oh. I don't know. I no, just kind of right though. <laughs> oh, it'll, oh, it's the scientist. It's a volcano. Wait, the what? answer is a volcano. Oh, I thought it was a Pokemon. No, well, the other person said, oh, it's a locomotive. Oh, oh okay. The I thought we were looking the other for person, a Pokemon. The other person said I was wrong. Oh, okay. And it might not be a living thing. So I went to the only other person. Gotcha. Yeah, I thought okay. I was thinking that. Oh, I didn't realize this was a chick. I was thinking we were talking about a Pokemon. No, I assumed as well. Oh, hey. <gasps> Squadman 8. <laughs> the evolved form of Squadman. Well, I mean, it'll always be Squadman 7. What? I've never seen a trainer use an X defense that before. That is a first for me, too. Huh. That was a good move, though. Well, uh, good luck, Varakaka. Um, Varakaka? When did Varakaka get over 40 health? Uh, when Varakaka was born, because Varakaka is super swaggy. I don't think that's the answer. You know, you know the part that disappoints me about Varakaka, and you brought this up between episodes, is that you need to trade it to evolve it. Yeah. So it's like, you know the phrase, if you love her, let her go? <laughs> I don't love Varakaka, so you can let her go? I'm not gonna let her go. To somebody else, and they'll give her right back. Oh. But like... I don't know, I just feel like that's a really... Oh, I should've just used takedown again. Probably. It's okay. We're just okay. Fight. Yeah. Good thing our squad man's faster than them and their squad man. Woo! It takes so little XP to level up, too. Like, I feel like it's leveling up every couple of battles. It is. Uh, return a book to its shelf after reading. Uh, okay. So, I'm, I'm gonna assume, like, it's the other trainer that I have to go talk to now? Yeah. Well, so question, if, if you, you heat, heat it up, up in, in a pot, pot, it'll be delicious. What is this? A lot of things? Yeah. That's that's very, very good. Okay, broad. well, her book is about Tepig. So... I, I'm reading about... I don't think yes? it's Tepig. Oh, I know, you're just kidding. <laughs> I'm not, but okay. <gasps> it's Puffins! I think. <laughs> Children's sweet, books. Sweet, sweet Pokemon. Pokemon. There we go. I'm assuming that's it. Yeah, Puffins. Puffins. It's P.O. Poofins? Wait, hold on. 
from this move two backward, one left, two forward, and one right, and one back. It's, it's the one right there. It's that one. Is it? Yeah. It was two forward, one left. I'm wondering, did you see the last memo and come to me? I'll give you the last question. Yes. No. <laughs> I felt like the answer was no. I felt like that was right. <laughs> oh, what is she gonna have? Oh, she has three Pokemon? It's normal. This is all normal type. Uh, I guess, okay, she has three weaker Pokemon. Yeah. That's it's one of these. That's you know, we should probably fair. stick to Veraka because normal is not that effective against rock types. But it just used bite. Wait, did Veraka get a good hold of all of its health back all of a sudden? Or did it like not lose any before? It hadn't lost any before. Oh. Huh. Veraka had, lo Veraka had lost like 3 HP. Dang. Yeah. Rock Blast! Bite. Eh. I'm, just, I'm just happy we never flinch. Yeah. I don't... Is it, maybe it has that ability. Maybe. I don't know. It is a hey, rock, rock thing. Hey, leveled up. 17! Mud Slap! Oh, dude, now we have a ground type move? Now we're rolling in the Benjamin's. Uh, what do you want to get rid of? Sand attack? Sand, oh, but I like sand. Uh, I guess it's Mud Slap Pokemon. achieves the same thing. Does it? It can also lower the accuracy. It's just not 100%. Okay, but that's the best part about sand attack, is it's just a straight up accuracy lower. No. Yes. Why, why is that so wrong? I'm gonna try it. Well, it oh my god. Us. It did like. Oh, it did oh, flinch. It flinched for once. So, what ability does it have? Stop biting! Oh my god. Uh, okay. You're gonna have to switch Pokemon or heal. Uh, Do BBQ. BBQ? Yeah, psychic type. But it knows bite. Well, we're gonna die then. Yeah. I forgot about the bite. I didn't. I did. <laughs> I just trusted you. Oh well, it's fine. Is it? Yeah, see? I'm just gonna side beam. I, oh, oh, we're dead. Yep, it, <laughs> that was a short-lived effort. Yeah. It's Maybe okay. we should heal one of our other Pokemon. Nah. We can get through this gym without healing. No, I don't think we can. I'm pretty sure we can. I'm pretty sure we're fucked if we you do just, that. You just need to have more faith in life. You know I don't. I really don't. Really? Yeah. That's actually disappointing. Man. <laughs> we're down to Ooh. 3 HP, so... Uh, Ooh, no, I'm gonna... I'm, we got this. Are you gonna use... A take down to just take it out. Yeah, yeah, we'll be fine. It won't kill us, right? You can't die from recoil. You know, I'm not sure. But we're about to find out. Yes, oh. you can. Did you know you can die from recoil in these you games? You know, I was pretty sure you could, but I would let you. I let you uh, do it. Figure that out on my own. Yeah. Oh. This is the last book. Well, she didn't tell us the answer. The biology of Tepig. Biology. Flame burns from inside his body, and it gives off flame from its nostrils. When it's not well, it can only give... No, it can give off only smoke. <laughs> Exclamation point! There's a memo between pages. <laughs> you, you managed, managed to, to get, get here. here. Well, well done. done. You seem to have some wisdom as well as strength. <laughs> that was... That was really hard. It took us all of eight minutes. Can we go and heal? Can we go in the secret staircase? If by going the secret staircase you mean heal, then yes. I don't... But I am willing to make compromises for the well-being of myself, because I feel like you would hurt me if I didn't go and heal. No, but you would hurt <laughs> our Pokemon. Can we just take a, like, can we mourn this Dragonite? No. Okay. It's just there. What are you going to do about it? Like, well, there's nothing I can do. <gasps> Wait. So, you know the Amazing Spider-Man 3 that's not happening? Yes. Did you hear what it was going to be about? No. Uh, Peter Is it going to be about Dragonite? All right, hold on. I Amazing Spider-Man 2 right spoilers. Okay. I'm gonna throw that out. Don't care. Well, like, to our audience, because so many people are watching. Well, it's about Peter trying to resurrect Gwen. Gwen Stefani? No, Gwen Emma Stone. Gwen Stefani? Emma... Gwen Stone Phony. Gwen Stone Phony, okay. Gwen Stone Phony. I got, we're on the same page now. Yeah. I mean, I'm pretty sure. Yeah. Yeah. Okay, so what about... <laughs> And, and what, wait, what, so what was 3 gonna be about? Him resurrecting Gwen. Oh, so he was she, going to achieve it? No, it's about him trying. Oh, okay. She, she dies in 2. Gotcha. Yeah, right? I thought that, I thought, oh, okay, I thought you were saying 2 in the end he was like trying to resurrect her or something. No. Okay. No, no she dies in 2. Okay. Anyway, so like, Secret Staircase? Yeah. Alright. You ready to find out what's down it? Yeah. Tomorrow Magic Hat? No, today. No, tomorrow. 